Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. On January 29, 2025, the semiconductor industry dropped a bombshell. Lithography giant ASML announced its fourth quarter financial report for 2024, with net sales of 9.263 billion euros, for exceeding the market expectation of 9.07 billion euros, a net profit of 2.693 billion euros, which shocked the global capital market and caused its stock price to soar. This set of impressive data is not just a string of numbers, but contains the key codes of industry change, market competition, and future trends. ASML can make a lot of money in Q4, and artificial intelligence, AI, has contributed greatly. At present, AI is developing in full swing. From OpenAI's various large models to Meta's large-scale AI infrastructure investment, global technology giants are spending money crazily to seize the AI high ground. And these breakthroughs in AI technology are inseparable from the support of chip performance. High-performance chip manufacturing cannot bypass lithography machines. As the world's leader in high-end lithography machines, ASML naturally became the biggest beneficiary. Take the most advanced high NA EUV lithography machine, for example. It can carve a circuit one thousandth the thickness of a hair on a chip the size of a fingernail, and is a magic weapon for manufacturing high end chips. In the past, this type of lithography machine had a small shipment volume and was ridiculously expensive. One machine could replace a luxury manor. However, with the surge in demand for AI chips, technology giants such as Meta have placed huge orders with ASML. In Q4 alone, three high NA EUV lithography machines were delivered, with an order value of 3 billion euros. This not only made ASML very profitable, but also consolidated its absolute dominance in the field of high end lithography machines. In the global semiconductor market, ASML's every move is a ripple effect. After the release of Q4 data, the entire industry is re-examining the competitive landscape. On the one hand, ASML's strong performance has put pressure on other lithography machine manufacturers. Companies like Nikon and Canon in Japan were once leaders in the field of lithography machines, but in recent years they have gradually fallen behind in the research and development of high-end lithography machines and the gap with ASML has widened. Faced with ASML's crushing development, they are in urgent need of finding new breakthroughs, otherwise their market share will be further eroded. On the other hand, the relationship between ASML and chip manufacturers is also quietly changing. Chip giants such as TSMC and Samsung are highly dependent on ASML's high-end lithography machines. In order to get lithography machines first, they not only have to pay high procurement costs, but also have to be deeply bound to ASML in terms of technology research and development, capacity allocation, etc. But this dependence also makes chip manufacturers feel uneasy. They began to try to diversify risks and increase support for other lithography machine suppliers. At the same time, they are also actively exploring new chip manufacturing technologies to try to reduce their dependence on high-end lithography machines. As the world's largest semiconductor consumer market, China has always been an important target market for ASML. In Q4 sales, China contributed about one quarter of the revenue. However, in recent years, due to geopolitical factors and other factors, ASML's export of lithography machines to China has been subject to many restrictions. In particular, high-end EUV lithography machines are almost banned from export to China. Despite this, the Chinese market is still very attractive to ASML. On the one hand, China's semiconductor industry is in a stage of rapid development, and the demand for key equipment such as lithography machines continues to grow. In order to meet market demand, Chinese companies have continuously increased their investment in the research and development of lithography machines. 
Although there is still a large gap with ASML, some phased results have been achieved. This allows ASML to see the potential of the Chinese market and feel the competitive pressure from local Chinese companies. On the other hand, ASML also understands that long-term restrictions on the export of lithography machines to China will not only affect its own market share and revenue, but may also prompt China to accelerate its pace of independent research and development and ultimately achieve domestic substitution of high-end lithography machines. Therefore, within the scope permitted by policies, ASML is also actively cooperating with Chinese companies to provide some mid- and low-end lithography machine products in an attempt to maintain its presence in the Chinese market. Looking to the future, ASML faces both huge opportunities and many challenges. From the perspective of opportunities, with the continuous development of emerging technologies such as AI, the Internet of Things, and autonomous driving, the demand for chips will continue to grow, which provides ASML with a broad market space. At the same time, ASML's leading advantage in high-end lithography machine technology will also make it the preferred supplier of global chip manufacturers for some time to come. But challenges cannot be ignored. First, technology research and development is becoming more and more difficult. As chip manufacturing processes continue to move towards smaller sizes, the requirements for the accuracy and performance of lithography machines are also getting higher and higher. ASML needs to continue to invest huge amounts of money in research and development to maintain its technological leadership. However, the research and development process is full of uncertainty, and once a technical bottleneck occurs, it may be surpassed by competitors. Secondly, market competition is becoming increasingly fierce. In addition to traditional competitors, such as Nikon and Canon, some emerging lithography machine manufacturers are also rising. They rely on innovative technologies and flexible market strategies to try to get a share of the high-end lithography machine market. In addition, factors such as uncertainty in the global economic situation and geopolitical conflicts may also have an adverse impact on ASML's business. The beautiful report card delivered by ASML in Q4 2024, is a reflection of its deep heritage and strong strength in the semiconductor industry. But in the ever-changing market environment, there is still a long way to go. Let us wait and see whether it will continue to lead the field of high-end lithography machines or face challenges from strong opponents.